6.05 to go, second period, 0-0 the score. Warriors causing problems in the offensive zone as they turn the puck over. Here's Pridham, left wing feed. Osmus moves in, left circle shot, and through the legs of Captain, the rebound loses the side of the net. Pridham put it on, and a blocker save. Somehow that puck stayed out with 5.50 to go in the second. Osmus put it on from the left circle, and it went through the legs of Captain and out the glove side. And somehow, I think it might have graced the post. It did on the glove side. And it's Capasso on the draw, and he'll take this against Oakenfold, who wins that over. Cohane across right side. Drury getting out through to center. Bouncing a puck in. Here's come Karen Humble behind the defense in on goal. And Captain keeps it out. Caden Kim Karen Humble with an opportunity as he was able to track down that bouncing puck, make his way to the front of the goal, and fighting through a couple of stick checks, got that puck toward net, and Carter Captain keeps it out and keeps this game 0-0. Tyler Wishart right circle. Here's Cotton to the goal and a blocker saved by Appleby. Under three to play in the second. Cranbrook coming with pressure. Blackley, right circle, drops it off. Malachi free to the net, scores! <laughs> it's Blake Cotton at the side of the net who deflects the puck in. And Cranbrook with 2.49 to go in the second period has opened the scoring and lead this game one to nothing. Frey put the shot to the net. Cotton tipped it in on the blocker side. Off of Appleby into the back of the net. Norland brings this back into the offensive zone. Right circle to the front of the net. That was knocked down and a centering pass from below the goal line by Karan. Is picked up by Cranbrook and brought the other way. Brought ahead at center on the left wing side. Here's Ferner. Right wing feed Silich back to the front of the net. Fletcher to the goal. And Appleby kept it out. Rorick Appleby two strong saves on the glove side. And keeps this game 1-0. Three on two rush there for the box. And it finished to the front of the net with Jacob Fletcher. A couple of good looks there at the front of the goal. And Rourke Appleby got across. He made two outstanding penalty upcoming here to Frey. Puck loose now is Wilson to the blue line. Power play upcoming for the Warriors. Here's Brooks to the front of the net. Redirected on by Oakenfold and a save by Captain. Down low is Wilson. Centering a pass. Prudham left circle. He scores! On the delayed penalty, Jack Pridham with a snipe up and over the blocker shoulder of Carter Captain. And the Warriors have tied the game and find the scoreboard. It's 1-1 with 7.51 to go in the third. Great pass from below the goal line. And Trent Wilson spots Jack Pridham with a wiring wrister for Brooks and ahead on the left wing side. It's pushed back along there through the middle of the ice. Knocked down in neutral ice. Here's Donovan Frias. Ten seconds to go. Got it up the middle. Bouncing puck side of the net. Gathered up here by Johannes Lockberg and the Warriors just controlling back inside of their own zone. That will run down the clock on regulation and we will play overtime here on this Friday night from Cranbrook. A little free hockey between the Warriors and the Bucks. 1-1 one, one after regulation. 60 minutes in the books. We're all square. Up left side for Blackley. Blackley to the right side for Cotton. Back for Blackley. Down low it goes. Here's Fletcher. Left wing half board. Up to the left point. There goes Captain to the bench for the extra attacker. As Fletcher moves in and scores. Jacob Fletcher in overtime with 16 seconds to go in the overtime period. Cranbrook gets the goal and takes the extra point, and the Bucks win it 2-1 the final score. For my knowledge, there is no delayed penalty. Captain was going to the bench. I don't know if he was going to go for an extra attacker to try and win the game in regulation, but it's Jacob Fletcher 